We're here at SEMA 2025 at the Edelbrock booth, and we're going to be talking about the Victor LSXR supercharger. Yeah, so the Victor LSXR is the first in a family of the Victor line. So if you think about Edelbrock products, traditionally, the Victor name has always represented the highest tier of performance. So the Victor okay. cylinder head is always a race head. The Victor intake manifold is a race manifold. Mm -hmm. So because this product is really focused on making big power numbers, we wanted to make a whole Victor family. So oh, the wow. first okay. one in that family is the LSXR. Okay. So what we did was we kind of took that branding from the fast LSXR manifold, uh -huh. which has been a very successful intake manifold for the LS platform. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. And we kind of use it, that equity in that uh -huh. name. It's a great name and it represents a lot of power behind it. A lot of power, very recognizable. Yep. So the core of this unit is a 3100 series rotor group. Okay. From Eaton, it's a Eaton TVS rotor group. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, so it's 3.1 liters of displacement. Mm -hmm. We we aim for optimizing high horsepower, but also giving ultimate control to the user. So you see the electronic valve here. So this is an electronic bypass valve. Okay. So basically, when this when the units assembled, this chamber is pressurized by boost mm -hmm. and this bypass valve allows you to recirculate that. So okay. in a traditional function, the reason for that is to protect the rotors and the throttle body when you shut the butterfly on mm -hmm. the throttle body you want to bypass that boost so it's not all backed up. Yeah, okay. Right? So that's the traditional function, but we thought, well, hey, well, if you're electronically controlling that, why not Why not create a boost control feature? Mm -hmm. So what we did was we developed a, a, a module that controls that, and that module is controlled by an app with Bluetooth communication. So with the app, you can set a maximum boost level. You can set a time-based boost ramp that will okay. start at wide open throttle you set a you, you define mm -hmm. okay when you exceed 50 percent throttle 70 percent throttle that's wide open start the timer for gotcha. the time-based boost ramp there's also a scramble feature I, so you can put a okay. you can add All a button like your it. steering wheel okay and uh if you don't have as much if you needed more power than you thought you did uh -huh. at the bump of the button you can increase your boost by a preset amount now for those of us that struggle with technology is it really easy to use the app for something oh, like it's, this it's super intuitive uh -huh. it's a it's going to be a free download or it is a free download okay. for an android or an ios device so you can put gotcha. it on a okay. tablet or a phone okay uh, it's real intuitive there's a menu you go in and, and where you just set the parameters up how you want to control the boost also on the app, you can monitor your intake air temperature, throttle position, engine RPM, and obviously So you can just boost. throw a phone mount up on the dash and have all your gauges right there without having to wire up all these extra things then. 100%. Then you're monitoring okay. everything to do with the supercharger. Does the app also store data? You can data log with the app mm -hmm. and play back all of that data on a graph. So okay. you can see what happened with your boost versus RPM. If you can see if the RPM spikes, you know, you spun the tires. Yeah. So maybe you need to be a little more conservative on the ramping in of the boost. Okay. Uh, so yeah, all that power is right there at your fingertips. Sweet. That is awesome. 3100 rotor group is proven to be very efficient. It's a brand new release from Eaton. Mm -hmm. And um, so we did all our testing on a 427 inch LS engine. Okay. So standard off the shelf parts. You can buy every part to build this engine from a catalog. Okay. And uh, we were able to make so far 1307 horsepower. But here's the cool part. Then with the app, we turned the boost all the way down and made 650 horsepower with the same back to back. So you've got so much control. You got mm -hmm. so much modulation, right? That's so you can sad. make, you can- You can you turn can, it down and have a nice cruiser. Yeah. And then turn it up and go to the strip. If you're right. auto crossing and yeah. you're, you're overpowering the car, you can just simply go on the app and, and tone it down to gotcha. whatever you want. And then if you tone it down too much, you can use a scramble feature to, to bump to, it back bump up it, yeah. mid run like in real time. Yeah. Okay. So that's a cool feature. Uh, it also has three intercooler bricks. Uh, there's two right here on the sides that uh -huh. sit right above each bank of runners. And then inside the lid, if you look, there's a, a, a primary brick. So basically we're circulating water through all three of these. As soon as the air comes out of the rotors, it goes through the first brick over into this chamber and makes a second pass down through these. So in our testing, 355 degrees of air right here, um, and it was 90 degrees of air in the intake runner. So there's that's an tremendous ability to, redu to uh, reduce that heat. Yeah, wow, okay. 
There's also uh, provisions for dual fuel injectors per cylinder. I was okay. I was just I was just so taking me, a glimpse. Let me see if I can tilt this over for you. So here's your primary injectors that are in the upper part of the runner, and down below there's a secondary set of fuel rails. So if your horsepower level or your fuel type requires more fuel than you want to get from a single injector, uh -huh. then you can add a second set of injectors. Okay. Bottom line, you got tremendous power potential. And we're not finished. We, we got a, we made some more revisions. In our final testing, we hope to achieve 1,400 horsepower. Gotcha. When, when do you think that'll be done? Uh, it'll be done before the end of the year. End of the year? Okay, so, so maybe at PRI we'll have those final numbers? I, I plan at PRI to have those final numbers. So come back by, we'll make a second video. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I appreciate your time. Yeah. Thank you. Great. Thanks a lot.